Los Angeles resident Susan Greenberg does not like what she sees just outside her window. You have this presence flashing. It's always there. It's always on. It's always flashing. Welcome to L.A., which some are saying has the worst billboard problem in the country. There are small signs, big signs, and then the super graphic signs are these very large signs. Uh, typically printed on material such as vinyl that are stretched on the side of a building, sometimes blocking windows. The swelling of signs has city officials saying enough, stopping new ads as L.A. considers its legal options, trying to reduce the sign sprawl, searching for visual order. What has people like activist Dennis Hathaway screaming out like a loud billboard are the digital signs. Every time the message changes on the billboard, then the light level changes. It's like like a TV that's on in a dark room. The city wants to ban new digital billboards. There has been an encroachment onto uh, not so much into the residential neighborhoods as right next to them. There are people living right on this street here. The sign industry says it is just helping advertisers reach customers. 70% of our business are local businesses and we don't want a solution in search of a problem. But the signs are a problem for the fire department if they block windows. Misdemeanor charges have been filed against some firms violating the rules. Changing habits may be tough in this city, where sign enforcement has been lax, and the biggest billboard of all has stood for decades. First put up promoting a housing tract named Hollywoodland. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.